Dear professors, dear colleagues, dear students, ladies and gentlemen, it is with some amount of pride and also with more than a little emotion that I have the pleasure of announcing today the decision of the boards of Sciences Po to appoint me for a second term at the helm of this institution. I am honored and humbled by the trust that has been placed in me. And I'm delighted to be given the opportunity to build upon the work that we have undertaken collectively over the last five years. The renewal of this mandate is a recognition of the contribution of all those of you who over the last five years have worked day in, day out to make Sciences Po stand out not just as the best university in its field in France, but also as one of the most attractive, creative, and innovative institutions in the world. It is thanks to you, and it is together with you, that we will continue to build a Sciences Po that combines academic excellence with the values that have inspired this institution since its very foundation. We will keep fostering the value of openness. Not only do we attract the most diverse talents from across the globe, but our openness also means encompassing new disciplines and innovative teaching methods. We will keep fostering inclusiveness, bringing together a diverse range of talented individuals strengthens and enhances the dialogue between students, researchers, professors and members of staff, and will extend this inclusiveness to the variety of subjects taught within the individual programs, because we mean to broaden our multidisciplinary culture by encouraging intellectual exchange between the humanities and social sciences and the so-called hard sciences. And we'll create a network of academic cooperation between like-minded institutions around the world. We will keep fostering innovation by placing digital technology at the heart of the education we provide, but by making sure also that the digital experience is central to the life of Sciences Po students and personnel within our new campus at Hôtel de l'Artillerie, a campus which, as you know, will open its doors at the beginning of the academic year 2021-2022, the very year when Sciences Po will celebrate its 150th anniversary. Today, with the benefit of hindsight, I am even more aware of the immense privilege that was bestowed upon me when I was entrusted with presiding over this singular and wonderful institution. I understand even more fully now what an enriching experience this extraordinary role has been for me since taking office in 2013. I would therefore like to extend my warmest gratitude to all of you, students, staff, professors, researchers, and partners. And I'm very much looking forward to continuing this challenging, stimulating, and exciting adventure together.